what's up guys welcome back to the channel so wow what a journey of last five six days you know we had so basically it's a journey towards north karnataka uh with three families you know exploring gundi mane location and after this we are going back to bangalore and then from there again our life of what i say robots starts where we go to office sit there work and come back Uh, right now we are in a very beautiful property called as the you know Gundi Mane you know you can just put it as G U N D I M A N E in Google Map download offline maps and then search then only you'll get it because this area is inside forest and you don't have any kind of network available initially i was a bit skeptical because it's the first time i'm coming to jog falls area and i thought this is the right choice to go with the you know uh, booking and later when we arrived here literally every single person did not want to leave this property come here come here and he's my little friend here so say hi say hi here say hi he's a very sweety uh, cutie pie who belongs to the property he's been very friendly to all the babies and kids and he's been playing around with everyone so this is the property which we are talking about it's called as uh, gundi mane it's a beautiful homestay you know which consists of multiple you know rooms available in it and very comfortable and uh, the property caretaker uh, there are two people um i'll get you the names of them i'll just quick give a give a quick introduction as well but before that i'll show you the property itself the whole you know area is covered with full of greenery and beautiful serenity you know you have plants flowers well maintained uh, gardens if you come to the right we have this parking zone where we can park our car right now my colleagues in my car are parked here uh, what they say is generally we can spot bison as well as you know deers in these areas somewhere here and you have a you know watched over there where you can climb up and see the complete uh, dam river that side i think sa sa saravadi saravadi some uh sanctuary dam is there so you can see that and it's full of plantation completely everywhere very beautiful place for children especially because they love playing here yesterday they were literally you know playing continuously that they don't want to go out that's how it, it was so we have few properties on top as well so you just need to climb this way and yeah so here again we have the complete agriculture and gardening i'm going to quickly take a picture on this camera here where is that where is that here just be here so that well, there's multiple peacocks actually down there as well we can find one here and find one there i don't have for yeah yeah i got it 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 here it is yep i don't know if you can see the clarity of it but yeah it's here lot of flowers and yep this is the entrance of the property we do not have any kind of facilities like this campfire because country this is a forest zone but you do have the privacy you can drink here not make too much of noise or you know enjoy but you can have a very peaceful uh, uh you know drink and and a fun entire mind so that's the place where we can sit and have drinks as well as you know uh play around and talk to people so once you get in you leave your slippers and your shoes here 
and then you finish off the registration part which happens here so basically you need to put your address everything and then you know put in all your details and with that you're done and we have some uh, spacious couch here to sit as well if you need you want to read newspapers something you can just drop in here and this is a very beautiful beautiful property you get in you have a beautiful door you know which is the entrance you have the peacocks you know the, the best thing about the houses they are so antique you know there are a lot of antique pieces which are available here which actually we feel and we see and we miss it as well you know when we are young kids so this is a room uh, like a hall which has been provided it has a tv and yeah cup well very well maintained and i really love the decor what they've done in the wall we have a, a small lobby here to walk upstairs to the our rooms we have a kitchen here so there's a quick dining table this dining table is specifically for uh, our home property owner they they sit here but they cook everything here for us so that's the mandir yep so this is the kitchen here so this is the general kitchen what they use and this is our mandir the temple here what they have very beautifully decorated and maintained so very unique so that's the temple what they have and once we are done here we go to the next room which is the dining room for the guests so basically we sit here and eat 12 to 13 people can sit and eat comfortably so the food gets prepared in the right side corner there we have a stove and yeah we have a wash basin to hand so very beautifully maintained and you know planned way of running a homestay and that we don't just have three rooms here we have more than that and then we have again a refrigerator given for the guests so that's our little one from one of our families so we can keep our chilled you no know, drinks here that's one two three four right now we have taken this room but when you come out we have a very spacious space you no know, space for us to have time for ourselves so we have a brick table with chairs we have a couch we have also a uh, this one bed and mattress there just to lie down and relax in the evening it's very beautiful sorry there are a lot of cloths we have just put it for drying because we came from gokarna we went for water sports everything is getting dry so you can see the beautiful scenery here it looks very nice during evening time you know when the sun sets and we hear here a lot of animals you know and uh, sounds as well as birds chirping and we have a cup of coffee it looks really nice it is so pleasant we feel that it's it's like home and we do not want to go back to our old life of city life you know that's how it is but it's very beautiful very well maintained a couple of minutes back we were playing uno here with all the you know all our friends here we're sitting and just uh, chillax and relaxing ourselves and yeah we did a quick party last night as well and then yep yeah, i'll i'll try to see if i can capture a quick video on the way through but what i'll do is i'll put a small slide on the right or the left you know which was possible on how the route looks actually so that you get a uh, no that feel of a forest you know you entering into and how you travel into all those things will be there you know will be seen that okay guys so we're going to quickly review a, a room right now all the two three rooms are occupied one room is free so we'll quickly get in so once you get in this is the way the room looks we have we can easily sleep three adults here and then we have a mirror with a mobile stand and then you have a beautiful cupboard very differently uniquely made so this has a lock here and then we have a table two chairs we have the plug points needed a beautiful wall art uh something into agriculture is what i feel because we have an agricultural house and then pongal celebration but this is into a karnataka style what they have made and we have the chickens there eating the corns and then a mother making her her, her or her you know, her baby bath and then we have a well wheat paddy coconut tree so beautifully made uh it's all handmade painting actually and then we have a quick uh, small screen available here you have the switches also available and then we have the utmost the bathroom so we'll quickly have a look at this a very neat and clean bathroom what they have maintain and you have the sun rays coming through this so early morning uh, uh, brushing is going to be very fantastic so and we have a fan available no acs uh, old age you know home style and then we have the lights and with that we have a loft as well to keep luggage if needed a lot of luggage and then we have a dustbin which has been provided so this is one of the room similarly we have another room 
on the other side this is the other room this is actually our room which i'm going to take so we have a beautiful brighting light again wall art is very different my baby is sleeping so i'm not going to disturb him so we have all the charging places available here cupboard similar thing only the difference is we have a bigger bathroom here which i always prefer so this is a very big bathroom a very clean and neat big bathroom you have a nature looking bathroom so what else you want you see the mountains you take a shower that's the best thing you can get so yes that's the two kinds of rooms like similarly we have other rooms also available we were able to spot few peacocks as of today we are excited to wait and see if i can see the bisons here because they say bisons are one of the creatures which moves across this land here so hopefully waiting for that to see if we can find one what a ending for a journey man seriously as uh, the year 2023 has ended really well for us you now we had some good memories to carry forward to 2024 surely my wife and my son enjoyed the whole trip you know we had some great time as i said we were able to cover everything as we planned and it did indeed help you know everyone to enjoy the max so hopefully we'll make more more uh, trips going forward and this group has been one of the best groups you know we have been working with each other you know it was like kind of you know like a family more than friends you know so we had some great time and luckily we got all the properties as one of the best properties uh, though i've gone to two of the properties i know how it works this property specifically in gundimane is something very special to us now because uh, we never expected that we'll get to feel such kind of a you know homestay you know inside a forest and such peace and serenity we get you know get you know so thank you so much for bringing up such a beautiful property responsible in charge in the building i'll give their details in the below description uh, with their contact number as well uh, the price details please do talk to him because it varies from season to season i will not be specifically able to tell you that this is the price price line but uh, you can reach out to them and talk to them uh, and get the current pricing as per the timeline when you travel so With this, I'll quickly go ahead and conclude, guys. Uh, we'll ha have a quick catch up in the next video. Until then, it's goodbye from your Bharat. Take care, peace out, and sayonara.